Hello, it's Emmy from Studio Emmy, and I'm here to show you one of my latest creations. This is a, a special order for someone who wants to give it to a girl who recently was engaged, and there's an album inside the box that I made that she can record her engagement memories and shopping trips for her bridal gown and attendance gowns and things like that. So I, I made a very feminine album. Um, I used Graphic 45, a lady's diary paper and embellishments and some ribbons and I just think it came out very nice and I'm, I'm happy to share it with you. So first is the cover and as you can see it, it's painted and covered with paper. I used the silk ribbon and other ribbons to tie it so um, let's untie it so you can see the cover. Here's a double strand. I think that looks real nice and some brads here, a little button with some ribbon, and I fussy cut the, the pretty lady here. Um, inside the cover, you'll see that I also painted that and then put some paper inside. And here's the album. I'll put that aside just for a second while I show you the rest of the interior. I put some paper in there to hold it up. Here's the interior painted and covered and the back also has some embellishment because I placed the ribbons under the chipboard to keep them in place. Back to our album. I tied this one closed as well um, on the side as I usually do and for the binding I used silk ribbon this time so a little different than what I usually do, but I like how it came out. It's very, very feminine. So let me just untie it and we'll get inside. You can see I fussy cut the pretty lady on the front here. And on the inside, I have some cards that the girl who receives it can use to record some memories. I put lines on the back. And did some stamping. I used an antique button to attach the ribbon, a vintage button from my collection. This is a magnetized um, folder for photos. It has a magnet to keep it closed and places to put photographs. Little embellishment with pearls it makes it easier to open. And over here is a tag that I made that she can use to commemorate her engagement. It has a little tab that says the ring. And I decorated a tag with some fancy lace. And on the back, lines where she can write about the proposal. I'm sure she has happy memories of that. To record, And here are some tabs where she can put photographs on the front and the back. I did a little bit of stamping. You can see a chandelier there. And there's a, one of the pretty ladies and there's bling at the top. It's a beautiful collection of paper. It makes a really nice feminine album. A place where she can put some photos that look like little frames around them. A pocket that I cut fancy cut and put some bling on it. It leaves some space on pages so that people can paste their own things to them. There's three little tags in here. One says memories, thoughts, and remember. And on the back there's some places where she can write. I use a chipboard embellishment with a little purse. I painted it and applied paper. Same thing with the shoes. I stacked those to make it look more like a pair of shoes, used an embellishment for the pocket here made of lace, and on this side I've continued using lace, I thought that was a nice touch of the feminine theme. Another pocket that I punched out with my one of my punches and put some bling on the lace here. And this says let's go shopping, and this is for her to record some of her shopping trips. And on the back there's those cute little ladies. Another one. And there's room for 
photographs on these because where the vellum is, I put some photo corners you can see. Those can be popped out and photographs can go on there. Same thing here. And same thing here. So she can do that. Or she can leave them as that is and use them in another way. I'm sorry I bumped the camera. Okay. Another pocket. This is a pocket page that I actually made. It's made from folded paper. Inside, I have a couple little fancy cuts from the paper line. So do some stamping. Do some lines so she could record things. Put some posted stamps. I built them up. And in here, there's a little, um, used a hanger at the top and she can record some of her shopping trips for her dress. And over here is the tag that's about the dress. This is from another collection that I had on hand and I thought the bridal gown worked really nice. Um, it says the dress there and there's a place on the back where she can just record what she wants to. I didn't put lines or anything because I thought she might want to use pictures or something. So I just left it like that. I left this blank because she might want to put a big picture here of her dress or her trying on the dress that she finally chooses to wear. I used one of my punches to make a pocket and inside I made a vellum envelope and I stamped it with a gate. Put a little bling on it and she can put things in there that she wants to keep for memories. Over here you'll see another vintage button that matches the one on the front cover. And I made a little photo book. It could be for photos, it could be for anything, but I think it'd probably be for photos. It just opens like this. Oops. And inside there's pretty papers all the way around. It has room for one, two, three, four, five nine photos. That's quite a bit. And then on the back, I placed a frame. And I left the top open so she can put something in there too. Maybe a picture of her and her fiance. So I think that she will like it and I hope she will. I was real happy with how it came out. So thanks for watching and if you have comments Please share them. Bye now.